bringing Christ to the nations and the nations to the church. Daily devotions from Lutheran Hour Ministries. Saturday, June 4th, 2022. His Unfailing Word. From Airmail, a devotion from Rev. Dr. Ken Klaus, Speaker Emeritus of the Lutheran Hour. Today's text comes from Isaiah 55, verses 10 and 11. The Lord said, For as the rain and the snow come down from heaven, and do not return there, but water the earth, making it bring forth and sprout, giving seed to the sower and bread to the eater, so shall my word be that goes out from my mouth. It shall not return to me empty, but it shall accomplish that which I purpose, and shall succeed in the thing for which I sent it. The Lutheran Hour's first radio broadcast of the gospel was in 1930. Its goal then, as it is now, was to bring Christ to the nations. Today, Speaker Rev. Dr. Mike Ziegler's weekly sermon is heard on more than 1,800 stations in North America, with 80-plus of those in Canada. The Lutheran Hour is the longest-running Christian broadcast in the world. But that doesn't mean our radio broadcast is the only way Lutheran Hour Ministries tells the saving story of the Savior. We also work around the world in Europe, Latin America, Asia, and Africa. In places like these, we help people who are hurting, people who often live in very desperate circumstances. In so many locales, people are struggling with poverty, sickness, famine, wars, and social unrest, with a world that is increasingly turning its back on those who can't help themselves. Lutheran Hour Ministries works with people like this around the globe. While our weekly radio broadcast carries the good news of Jesus Christ over the airwaves, on the ground, LHM staff and volunteers serve others right where they live. In all these ministry efforts, we look to our text from Isaiah, where the Lord promises, when his word goes out, it's not going to fail. Yes, some of the seed may fall on hard ground, while some may sprout and then die. But some of it will grow and bring forth a beautiful harvest. That is our prayer at Lutheran Hour Ministries, that God will bless our labors and that his word may go forth, bringing hope and light to those in need. By the Holy Spirit's power, God's word will accomplish what he intends. And it is his good and gracious word that will continue to touch people's lives with the power of the Savior being a light to the nations and bringing salvation to the ends of the earth. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless and protect those who share the good news of Jesus with others, here and around the world. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. <laughs>